Welcome back everybody, Canadian Silver Saver here, and I have just a quick video for you on this Saturday evening here, at least it was when I filmed this video, so it depends on when you're watching, but I wanted to share another trade I did with Teddy Jones. So Teddy Jones has been uh, a great supporter of my channel, has really been reaching out to me recently, and uh, the timing is great, and I think something I just want to let everybody know out there, uh, I, I haven't shared some things, and there's been uh, just some stuff going on in life, and I think there will be a point that maybe I share that in the video, but, uh, um, you know, I'm just not overly quite comfortable with, with, you know, being forthcoming with all of that right now. Some tough times in my personal life, and I hope that everybody out there that knows me and uh, maybe hasn't heard from me as often as they, they have in the past can hopefully understand that uh, I'm still here, I'm still supporting, I am watching, and, uh, you know, it's, uh, sometimes I just need to uh, kind of refocus on things. But if my friends are out there and you want to, you want to give me a, a shout, you want to chat sometimes and talk about some silver and gold, please reach out to me. I love, uh, I always love doing that. And that's what uh, Teddy's been doing with me here. And this is that recent trade. So he uh, decided he was going to do some blackening of some coins. And we were talking about different coins that he was trying and he sent me some pictures of some silver eagles and uh, Canadian maple stuff like that so this was I asked him if he would consider blackening a uh, Libertad so there's the other side in all its glory um, and then you know there's quite a few people out there that do some great job on blackening and that and I think we want to encourage new artists to try things and uh, you know try their own style to it as well and that's what uh, Teddy Jones is doing here and I hadn't seen anybody blacken a Libertad and that might just be through circumstance, but I thought that'd be perfect for me because I love my Libertads I love my Mexican silver and uh, Just a beautiful piece. So thank you Teddy Jones. I really appreciate you doing this for me and doing the trade and uh, uh, Just fan, you know fantastic piece. So very very cool. Keep it up. Uh, oh, I gotta show make sure we sold the show the sides there. Can't speak today. <clears throat> There we go. We even got the, the coloring right in there. That's so cool. Uh, but yeah, everybody out there, if you uh, you know, like, if there's ever a time, maybe I can chat to people. If you're, you know, give me a shout. I um, it's one of those uh, one of those times, and I'm sorry if I'm not in touch with as normal, and uh, that's not something you know I really want to put out in the world, kind of thing. But uh, I, I miss some of my friends. I haven't been talking to as much, and I'd love to hear from you. So. Hopefully everybody's doing well. Hopefully everybody's had a great start to their year. And uh, hopefully I'm putting up some videos that you really enjoy. So please hit that like button. Share the video so lots of people see them for me. And uh, remember to hit that subscribe so you don't miss out on any upcoming videos. Thanks everybody. And uh, as soon as Teddy Jones gets uh, his logo and stamp and stuff done, I'll share that with you. He's going to be doing uh, lots of great stuff moving forward. So stay tuned for that. And we will talk to you soon. Take care.